What's going on YouTube? Snipes here with TKO Gaming here in the Wrath of the Machine raid in the Splicer's Den. Um, this was probably one of my most favorite and easiest parts in the raid. Uh, once again, what you guys want to do is split up into three groups of two. Two on the left, two in the middle, two in the right or on the right. You want to make sure that each of your teammates are focusing on the ads coming from each way. You want to be careful of the boss's Scorch Cannon. Uh, pretty much kill the enemies and check out my raid scout rifle that I'm using. Um, and then kill the enemies and just make sure that those red balls after you shoot the guys with the guns, uh, after you kill them, those red balls come and they track. After you hit those red balls for the first time, it actually strafes to the right or left. So it's a pretty cool mechanic that uh, Bungie put into the raid. But after these uh, dudes are just dying, there will be some bombs that drop. Uh, we just refer to them as the balls. Just make sure that each teammate in the on the left, in the middle, and the right are all familiar with you know their who's picking up the ball, and then you all have to throw it together. Now, this was a uh, something we messed up in the raid. I wanted to keep it in the raid video for you guys. The reason why that happened so early, and the reason why it happened was because we forgot to shoot a monitor when you forget to shoot a monitor um a, a monitor will pop up with some weird writing on the front left middle right and just got to call it out for your team you have to shoot that monitor if you don't then he starts his little animation you have to find a room you have to quickly go into that room okay there's four rooms total you can only use the room once so you pretty much have four chances to use that now keep in mind, if the raid boss, after you do damage, he will once again do that little phase and you'll have to go into a room. So it's very important that you guys shoot those monitors. Otherwise, you guys are going to be continuously going into those rooms. And then after you do DPS for the damage phase, you're not going to be able to have a room to go into. So we're, I'm almost 100% sure you can two wave kill this boss. And if you mess up, make sure one of the main things that we were doing wrong here were one of the people throwing the balls was always missing. So what that does is it adds another wave of enemies and it, you know, time is wasted. The boss can go enraged. A lot of bad things can happen. So I'm putting this tutorial here for you guys. So you guys see the mistakes we're making, yet we still do complete it. So it's definitely doable. It is the easy version of the raid. The hard mode is probably going to be a lot higher and the room for error is going to be a lot less. So once you guys pick up the balls and you're going to throw it at the um, boss, you want to make sure you look at his health. It takes three waves of ball throwing at him for his shields to go down. Then everyone meets in the middle to do damage. Everyone just weapons of light, tether, two extra balls will drop to even do more damage on him. I think it does about 107,000 damage plus depending on your light. So it's pretty massive damage. You want to make sure you guys are doing it all together inside weapons and all sorts of things so after this you'll notice that his he starts his little phase thing where you have to run into a room quickly uh, you want to make sure you get into a room and then shoot the room to make it a safe room uh, there's a little panel on the right when you enter and you'll see exactly what we're doing once you shoot that the room becomes a safe room and then after he does his phase, you just rinse and repeat and do it again until the boss is dead. So I really hope this tutorial helped you guys. I have other tutorials as well, as you guys know on the channel. Make sure you guys share this video and share my other tutorials with your friends. It really helps if everybody can visually see and understand what the mechanics are. So when you go and do the raid, it's that much easier. So I really hope my videos help you guys out. If you guys like this video, let's see if you can get three likes in this video. That's all I'm asking for. And let's also... Make sure we check out the description below. Come check us out on Twitch, on Twitter. Stay fully connected with us. Uh, we stream almost every single day. So yeah, just keep just come and come and connect with us. God damn it! All right, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. A lot more videos to come. Thanks so much for watching. Peace out.